Yo guys, what is up? It's Teach here coming at you again with another video over on Ark Survival Ascended. And I wanted to show you kind of a mini breakdown of all of the different things that are involved with Ark Survival Ascended and mutations, breeding, everything. So I'm doing a mini series. This is my first video on that. I'm going to cover small chunks, right? Because sometimes videos get so long. If I really wanted to talk everything about mutations and all that kind of stuff, we're looking at like a three hour video to explain everything. So I'm going to break everything down into small chunks that are easier to understand. This is the beginning of that series. I'll have a playlist so you guys can all see that. But this is the video for what is a mutation in ARC. If you don't mind, smash that like button, leave a comment below for the algorithm, and then consider subbing to the channel. I'm starting to creep towards 100K, and that's been my goal all along. So this is what it looks like when you get a mutation, right? You get these crazy cool uh, fancy color dinos. And uh, yeah, that's what they look like. However, the real value of a mutation is it's an increase in stats, okay? So if I have all level one animals or creatures inside of ARC, there are zero points into any statistics, anything, right? Because they have zero points, they're considered a level one. I know it's kind of hard to see that on the right-hand side, but you'll have to trust me when I say there are zero points in any single statistic inside of this creature. And you can see right now, zero, 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 zero. I haven't leveled it at all. Even though it has levels, there are zero points into it. So a mutation occurs when you have two normal level dinos of any level, doesn't matter what kind. And one of them gets a bonus level or I guess bonus point inside of a mutation that gives them a total of two levels inside of a single statistic. So for example, what that means is this Ekus and this Ekus, or whatever you want to call them, horses, I don't care. They breed, right? So these two breed. They have an offspring, and it looks like this. Now, obviously right off the bat, when this is born, you can see, wow, it's got different colors. However, if you look at the level, you can see those are level one, and this one is level three. So that is what a mutation is. It's literally adding in points into a statistic, just one statistic, in order to make a dino better overall. Now here's some cool things, right? Some cool little statistics for you. Whenever you get a mutation, you get a random color generated. It could be one, it could be three, it could be unlimited number of colors. However, it's also gonna be, excuse me, focused on the areas that can actually be presented. So you can see this, this horse, and it, on the bottom of the screen, I guess on the right hand side, you can see the three colors that are present. So you have a six, a three, and a two. It can technically get a random mutation in any one of those spots. And those are the ones that present. Now here's where it gets a little funky as well. It can also get a mutation inside of those hidden three because there's a total of six possible areas and it can get in any of those six areas. It can have a color mutation and it might not show as present. So all of that being said, the point behind this is to tell you that a mutation occurs and is obvious when you have a color change in a dino and a plus two in the level, which means you have plus two points into a single statistic. Now this horse specifically, you can see the parents start with 240 health. That is how much health, just in case you can't see it, here's kind of like a zoom in for you. 200, and thank you for pooping on me horse, 240 health is how this thing started. When this horse came out, it did not have 240 health, it had 336, but all of the other stats were exactly the same. So we know, because the other two were the same exact stats, that this one got a mutation because it went up two levels. Now, if you have the binoculars like you can see in my hand right now, you can see in the middle of the top where the health is listed, the middle column says two. Now I know that can be hard to read, so I'm sorry, I don't have a better way to give that to you guys, but that means that it's got a mutation. So. All of this is to tell you that mutations make your dinosaurs and your creatures inside of ARC better. They will 100% make them better. Now, I'm not going to go into the other advanced things because there's mutations, there's double mutations, there's combo mutations, there's bad mutations, all kinds of stuff. This video is just to tell you what a mutation is. Some people get confused that it's some sort of like special custom dino. It's not. It is literally one offspring from a mother and a father creature in this game that has a increased individual stat. Now, the last thing I'm gonna to add to this, there is a single and a double mutation. A single mutation will give you bonus two levels and a double mutation will give you bonus four levels. Now that double mutation could be in the same stat or it can be split into two different stats. So instead of having a level one horse 
that came out with no mutations, I have a level three here. If I had a double mutation, it would be a level five horse. So that is exactly what mutations are inside of Ark Survival Ascended. Kind of broken down, nice and easy for you. Hopefully it helps you. If you don't mind, smash that like button, leave a comment below for the algorithm, and then consider subbing the channel. And I'm gonna continue this series and kind of break things down more complicated as we go, but that's what a mutation is. All right, teach out.